Today, we have a muscle car mug, a nice Paris Americano. The car is already ripped apart, but now we're in 4K, so I wanted to show off the good footage in the beginning of the video. And right now, we're gonna go through the process of what it took to get the body, the body separated from the frame and lift it up in the air. So let's get to that footage. Body back on frame in three, two, one. Coming underneath the car with me here, you can see clips here with the Phillips screw just fired into the body. So I'm just gonna zap these clips off first and then we'll get ahead to zapping off the 13. So well, that one's not gonna come out. Let's go, other side. Extra crispy. Give it a whirl. <clears throat> all right guys, so I just started prying. We took all the bolts out, the interior ones included. You see, the whole body is loose. So I got the floor jack with the block of wood underneath the front nose, and then I jacked it up a little bit. I jumped on the frame head here, and uh, she came loose, so. You can see it's up in the air from the jack stands, the frame, and the rear end is not moving yet as, quite as much. So I'm not sure if I missed something or if it's just really stuck back there. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, try to figure that out right now. This looks like it's figured out the mystery. So you can see here that the body is very compressed by this section of the floor. And if we come underneath here, you can see that somebody tack welded it right there on both sides. I don't know if you see it there, but so they tack welded the body to the frame. Grab the grinder or even the sawzall and just chop this piece of uh, member out and uh, we'll all just grind the weld one of the two and it should break free. The other side's probably the exact same thing and that's the only thing holding us up. So let's continue on. Alright guys, so it's in the air. You can see here there's a decent amount of air gap. The body is floating. It's all on the cherry picker. So we ended up adding a second strap looped through here once we pried. I put the jack underneath the back corner, lifted it, got the strap through. We got that. Um, now the body's in the air. We're gonna lift it up higher and see where we take it. Obviously the rear end's heavier than the front. No surprise. So we should have moved this strap further back. So hold on, we're gonna set it back down while we still have a chance. And we're gonna move this strap further back.
put that fuel line. It's pulling on that fuel line now. The two by four for the headliner right on the top. Or, or you can do that, yeah. This straight picker can go all the way up. You gotta move it though. Yeah. This is touching yeah. well, This has gotta go forward and then up. If you can get it all the way up here, it'd be better. Yeah, it'd be but the if best. You can't, you do it here, you push up here, that's it. As soon as the car's over, one guy slides them through. 